Never thought I'd say this, but good thinking, Lenny. I got the idea from Lincoln's coloring book. Thanks for the dough! <laughs> Just hurry up and make us famous! This, this needs, needs to be mailed, mailed by 4 o'clock! What are you, you doing? doing here? Is that a comic book? Or what? No! I mean, shouldn't you boys be in detention? It is a comic book! The Adventures of Ace Savvy and the Principal Valiant by Wilbur T. Huggins! <gasps> You're entering the Ace Savvy contest? And your name is Wilbur? Look, new commemorative stamps! <laughs> so that's why you confiscated our comic book and put us in detention to knock us out of the running! Okay, okay, I did it, but I had to. When I heard how great your comic was, I knew mine wouldn't stand a chance. But, sir, why is a comic book contest so important to you? You're a successful school administrator. You got your own golf cart. Yes, it's true, I have it all. But it wasn't always this way. When I was your age, I didn't have a lot of friends. But I had Ace. Yeah, get him, Ace. Way to deal out some justice. <laughs> Look at him. Those comics meant the world to me. I wanted to win the contest so I could meet Bill Buck and thank him for getting me through a lonely childhood. But I went too far. I'm sorry, boys. You deserve to win, not me. As Ace Savvy would say, deal me out. Wow, I guess there's more to Huggins than meets the eye. Yeah, and his story just gave me an idea. Principal Huggins, wait! wait. Oh, yes, of course. You'll need my administrator ID to report me to the school board. No, we're not reporting anyone. Clyde and I get it. Ace has gotten us through some tough times, too. Yeah, like when Lori first got together with Bobby. It was a rainy Tuesday. I wore suede shoes. That was a mistake. I think he gets the idea, Clyde. Huh?